Hi everyone, so today I am going to be doing a product review on my Aromatherapy Essential Oil Diffuser. I have my laptop here in front of me so that I can give like really great info for you guys, just in case you're wondering about what light is hitting me, probably not. But I had recently shown my diffuser in like a cleaning video and I asked if you guys wanted to see a review, a product review on it and a lot of you said yes so that is why I'm doing this video but I did want to give myself enough time to actually use it to try it out, see how I felt about it, decide if it was actually working, you know, before I did a review for you guys. So it's been a while and I feel like I have enough information to talk about it and tell you guys how I feel about it. The overall, I'm just going to tell you the overall right now, I love it. I did order two and I did get mine from Amazon. So if you're interested in my specific um, essential oil diffuser, I will link that one down in the description box below for you. I don't know these people. They're not asking me to talk about this. This is just something that I've been wanting to put in my bedroom and in my daughter's bedroom to sort of purify the air more. I know that's not really what it's supposed to do, but the essential oils like are supposed to do really great things for you. So the overall purpose of an essential oil diffuser is it basically takes water and your essential oils that you buy for it. So you do have to actually buy another product to use with it. You have to buy your essential oils that you're going to pour into your diffuser and then your diffuser works to throw that out in a steam-like way. It's not really hot at all. There's no heat to it whatsoever. So according to this, it says no heat is required. So oils are not broken down or degraded. It's just a really nice, beautiful mist. And combined with the water and whatever essential oil that you drop into it, that is going to give you whatever benefit comes with the essential oils. And there are so many different types of brands for essential oils. There are different essential oils that do different things. So I'm also going to talk about the essential oil kit that I purchased. I think I got this at TJ Maxx for $14.99 and I got four in here, which is, was a really great deal because individually some essential oils can be up to like $5 each. So for $14.99, this was not a bad price at all. So I'm gonna read off of this because I don't know everything there is to know about um, essential oils off the top of my head or the diffuser. So let me tell you all the great benefits to what it's supposed to do for you. So it's said that it can help with allergies, sleep, cold, and flu-like symptoms. It can also give you a spa-like feel in any room, which I completely agree with. It does feel like nicer and it makes your room feel more inviting and comforting. Like I just love it. Every night I have to pour in my little water, pick whatever essential oil that I'm gonna drop into it, and then I set the color that I like and we'll get into all that. But when I come into my room, I just love it. Love it, love it, love it. So the diffuser is supposed to help hydrate the room and increase the air moisture to help with colds, coughs, dry sinuses, congestion, dry and cracked skin. So, so many health benefits. This specific essential oil diffuser is called the Aromatherapy Essential Oil Diffuser 7 Colors, 120 milliliter portable ultrasonic cool mist aroma humidifier with changing color LED lights waterless auto shut off. That's a long name, okay? But I will link it all in the description box below for you. It costs $19.99. And overall, how I feel about this is it's great for the value. Now, here are the um, issues that I've had with it. So these do come in different sizes for like how much water it can handle. So this one's 120 milliliters. I, I think that's how I'm saying it correctly. And I know that it doesn't last through the night. So usually I'll put it on at about like nine or 10 p.m. And when I wake up about six, sometimes five, it's running, but there's no mist anymore. So if you do want something like this to last through the, through the night, I would definitely suggest looking for one that, that can hold more water. And I've seen some on here that hold like 200, 300 milliliters. So there are a lot of great options and they're really not that much more expensive than $19.99. So I'm looking at one right here and I'll post a picture of it for you. It's a 300 milliliter and it looks almost very similar to this one. It also has the color LED changing lights and it's $33.99 
from Amazon. The other thing that I probably would have done different is I would have gotten a different body style. So this is very white, it's very plain. So if you have so if you have like a very modern feel to your room or maybe you've got like the Alex IKEA five drawer system and you love white and all that, then this is perfect for that, I think. But I have more of like traditional warm colors, so I wish I would have gotten one that has like a wood effect to it, and I'll link a picture of that too so that you can see what I'm talking about. But otherwise, other than those two things, wishing that it held more water to last through the night and having like a different like body style to it, other than that, I really have enjoyed this diffuser and I use it quite often, almost every night pretty much. So this is how it works and I'm going to attach a video for you so that you can see how I do this. But basically I just get the little beak, it comes with like a little container that you can fill up with water. I pour it all the way to the line and on the inside of your diffuser, it will tell you the stop line for water. And then you pick the essential oil of your choice, whatever it is that you need to help you with. Maybe it's like acne or cough or, um, sore muscles, anything like that. You just pick the essential oil of your choice. You drop in a couple of drops, two to three it says, and it actually does vary based on how much water you're holding. So for this specific one, it says two to three drops of essential, of essential oil. And then you just put the cap back on, twist it, and then you can set your modes. And it has two different modes. So it has one with continuous mist, and it will just mist, mist, mist until it runs out of water and the oil or you can set it on 30 second spurts. And that's usually what I set it on because continuous mist sometimes is a little overpowering, especially depending on the essential oil that you use. So for instance, I have one that's a grape essential oil, grape, a grapefruit essential oil, and the smell is really strong for me. So there's no way that I could put that on like a continuous mist. And then I set my color. And what's really cool about this one is that it can, it just changes colors. It says seven colors, but when you put it on the multicolor, it transitions into a lot of different colors. And usually I will pick either somewhere in the blues or somewhere in the purples. Those are my favorite colors to choose from. I normally don't keep it on the rotating color just because I don't want, um, the lighting in my room at night to like constantly change. I just want one set color and that way I can fall asleep. The very last thing that we need to talk about are the essential oils that you're going to pick. So I really don't have enough information to be like the most knowledgeable person out here to tell you what essential oils are the best. I will tell you that what I've seen on like, um, Amazon, what I've also just happened to have watched on Jaclyn Hill's Snapchat, she's really big into essential oils, and I'm a huge believer too. I am a huge believer that things like garlic and lemon and all of that can really cure a lot of illnesses. So I'm definitely a big believer of aromatherapy for Sure, I got rid of my cough on my own for the very first time without getting antibiotics, without getting all those steroids on my own with tea and garlic and all that stuff. So I won't get into all that, but I'm just letting you know that I am a big firm believer. But with that said, again, I really don't know that much about essential oils and which ones are the best and which ones aren't. So it may have to be like trial and error or you can do a lot of research before you decide what brand you're going to go with. So the only reason why I even bought this was because one, I saw it at TJ Maxx and it was very reasonably priced. So I was like, I'm gonna go ahead and try this, but let me tell you the kinds that I have in here. So that way you get an idea of what essential oils are if you don't know what they are. So each one serves a specific purpose, okay? So in here I get eucalyptus, lavender, tea tree, and grapefruit. One is missing because one's in my daughter's room. So eucalyptus says it's useful in the treatment of respiratory problems, wounds, and muscle pain. Eucalyptus is a brilliant aid in fighting inflammation, congestion, and bacteria. So perfection. I mean, if you have some sort of issue in that category, set up your aromatherapy and get it going. Lavender, we all know really lavender is known for its calming effects. Lavender can be beneficial for helping calm nerves and aid in insomnia relief, ease pain, and possibly even boost your immune system health. Amazing. So lavender is actually the one that's in my daughter's room. The next one is tea tree. 
With its ability to inhibit bacterial and viral infections, tea tree oil speeds up the healing rate of scars and helps naturally treat acne-prone skin. Amazing. Grapefruit, while grapefruit is known for its detoxifying properties, it also aids in relieving fatigued and sore muscles and can also help in the relief of stress. So grapefruit is not a fruit that I like at all. It's extremely painful for me to try to eat because it's just, ugh, I don't like it. So the smell is really difficult for me to get used to, but that's why I put it on my 30 second spurts when I want to use grapefruit. And then by the time I fall asleep, I don't really notice. It doesn't keep me up at night. And the great news about these essential oils is they do last for a really long time. So if you are gonna end up spending 30 something dollars on a whole kit, you're going to get a lot of different oils that you can use and they will probably last you the whole year, if not more than that, depending on how often you use your diffuser. Another thing that I was reading about it, it says that it's a great for gifts. It's portable for the gym, yoga, baby room, office, or a bedroom set up to about 150 square feet, and that's specifically for this diffuser here, okay? So it's perfect gift for family and friends who love aromatherapy or can benefit from aromatherapy healing. I completely agree with that. These are great gifts. Some people don't realize that there are things out there like this that, you know, would be exciting to have. I absolutely love having mine. As a matter of fact, I'm probably going to get another one and put it in my office. That's how much I love it. And I hope that you guys enjoyed this review. I'll link everything down in the description box for you. Please be sure that you research exactly what you want. Thank you so much for suggesting this review. I hope that you really enjoyed it. I will always continue to use my essential oil. Chances are I'll probably take this one and put it in my office and then I'll buy like a different one with like a wood feel for my bedroom but I love it. So thank you so much for watching and I'll see you soon. Bye.